guys, how's it going? My name's Helena, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm seeing as the clouds are still looming um, and I'm not really sure what's going on with the weather at the moment, I'm gonna be building my primary imaging rig inside um, the observatory here in my back garden. So I'm gonna be bringing the EQ6R um, and the 80 ED actually down today rather than the Esprit. The den flap is unfortunately seized shut so we can't open it at the moment. Um, I am working on building like a portable imaging rig, so something like a star tracker and a camera and um, for going out capturing dark sky events, maybe meteor showers, things like that. And um, we've got a really good dark sky area here where we are. So as I said, I'm working on that at the moment with my tripod and my camera. Um, last night I photographed the Orion constellation, was super happy with the image considering the specs, um, but I'll talk a little bit about that later. So I'm just gonna bring all the equipment down and start setting up and getting ready. The reason I'm having all the main equipment in the den is because I live in Scotland and the skies aren't very reliable. One minute it can be clear and the next minute it can be raining. So I want it inside so when I'm running an imaging session, I can quickly shut the flaps if the weather starts to change. And with that all being said, guys, and that little update done, let's get on with today's video. the main parts of the primary imaging rig put together I just need to put the counterweight on um, like attach the camera put a table up for the laptop cables things like that as for the den flap unfortunately we've no idea when it's gonna get fixed and um, it could be anywhere between now and summer we really don't know the guys that are coming up and um, from England to do it have a really tight schedule um, and we appreciate that so um, I've just decided to set it up in here so when they do come and fix, I'm out like that as soon as the clear nights um, set in. So let's go back to me filming the Orion constellation last night. Um, I took 28 second subs at ISO 1600 and F4. They turned out really well considering um, I didn't do any darks. The M42 is a little bit blown out. I need to do a little bit more editing to try and solve that issue. Um, but I'll put the photo up here. I'm really happy with it. It looks pretty nice considering it was just with a tripod, no tracking mount, and it was just 20 little simple subs. So it was really nice to get under the clear skies finally. Um, it was really simple setup, just tripod and camera. As I said earlier, I'm working on a portable setup, which is really exciting. So you should be seeing much more content with that very soon. Um, so as for the primary imaging rig, um, that's holding off for the moment. Um, but we're going to see some beautiful things out of it this year, I can assure you. That's all I have for you guys today. If you have any comments or suggestions on star trackers, please let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear what you guys think or if you have any experience with anything of the sort. I appreciate you guys probably watched just to see me use the primary imaging rig. I promise, yes, that will be coming. But there are some things we have to see to before that happens. This year is going to be an amazing year for astrophotography, I just know it. And I'm super, super excited um, to get a portable setup and my primary setup all done and finished and ready to go. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one, which will probably be an imaging session with my new portable setup. I'll see you guys in the next video, but until then, happy stargazing.